now, though, it's the moment of truth. We've been giving you clues, haven't we, throughout the show. Have you guessed that the next Dancing on Ice contestant is... Da -da 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 -da! It's Amber! Amber Davis, come in. <laughs> come, come, come. It's so nice to see you. You're Thank very you brave. Thank you for having me. Very brave to be doing that. Have a wee seat. <gasps> Thank you. Well, it's out there now. It is. It is, it is, it is. How are you feeling about it? Do you know what? I've been in this Dancing on Ice bubble. Right. And today it feels real. Right. Now I can't go back. No, you can't. It's happening. It's out there. Can you actually ice skate? No, so I can count on one hand how many times oh. I've actually ice skated. Right, because did your dad not say you weren't supposed to ice skate? He wasn't really happy. Yes. Yeah, when so you were little, I mean. When I was younger, because my dream was to be on stage, yeah. my parents always used to say, just in case, you know, we, we won't let you go. Um, and then in secondary school, all of my year went skiing and I was the only person that didn't go because my parents right. thought, well, it's too dangerous and she wants to be on stage. So, so what if, you know, you have re-accident? They didn't want that to happen no, to stop your dreams. Just in case, just in case. Maybe they were wise in I a know, way. I because, know, I um, know. How do they feel about it now, though? I, I was just saying, I'm 27 <laughs> next week and I was still asking them for permission. I said, Mum and Dad, would, would you Is mind? Okay? <laughs> and they were like, you'll be in safe hands. You know, I'm going right. to have an amazing pro who I don't know yet. Yes. Um, but... And you up for everything. I am. For even that mad headbanger thing that just, oh my <laughs> lord, and you don't get to wear a cap. That, that there, <laughs> yikes, Amber. Are you going to do that? Someone said, oh. do you want to do the headbanger? I said, I'd love to get that out in week one if I can. Right, just get it out the way in yeah, some way. Yeah, exactly. But look, you're going to have a lot on your plate because yeah. it's it's wonderful. You've got this uh, this new job mm -hmm. um, as, as Pretty, Pretty Woman. woman. Vivian now, Ward. that was a big deal, wasn't it, to get mm -hmm. that part? I think for me, I'd been gunning for the role for so long because it came to town, it came to the West End in 2019. That's right. And I'd gone in for it, but I was just so young, Lorraine, you know? Right. And now I'm now I'm older and wiser. I, I never could have played that role at 22. That's interesting and good that you yeah. recognise that. Yeah. I'll tell you what, though, your mum was a bit pleased. Here's her oh. reaction when you got the part. Oh, MJ! <laughs> That's great to have their support like that. But you have, I mean, you've springboarded. In fact, to be honest, I think most people forget you, you were in Love Island. Mm. But that was a good way of getting attention of being able to say, hello, I'm here and yeah. I want to be in the West End and this is what I want to do. Well, do you know what? And Actually, saying happened. that, I was surprised. I was elated and over the moon when I even got the call for Dancing on Ice because I hadn't been on telly in so long. Right, OK. I thought... I thought that kind of ship had potentially sailed. Because you were concentrating on the West End. Because I, yeah, you know, I picked you my do. path sure. and I thought, and I've been working hard. Mm. And when I spoke to the producers and I said, uh, you know, why me? They said, because you're doing so well in, in your industry. And, right. and for in that moment, I really did feel like my hard work is paying off. Mm. You I'll know? tell you what, I've always said this and I've said it to you many times, but yeah. the, the West End, if you can do that, you can do anything. Mm. Because you have to work your butt off. I know. You know, the, there's no hiding place. The, that, there really isn't. That's why I feel like, although I'm doing Pretty Woman and Dancing on Ice pretty much at the same time. Oh, Amber, jeez. <laughs> I know. <laughs> doing eight shows a week, you have to be mentally and physically prepared. And I, I think they're going to go hand in hand mm. quite well, especially with stamina and things yes. like that. Because you need to have the stamina of a pit pony. You have to be on it. You yes. really do. Now, I was talking to Melinda Messenger and she met her man while she was doing SES and you met your fella when you were doing Back to the Future, yes. didn't you? Yes, That's ben. fantastic. So you both Aww. know what's required of you. You get, you know, you have that short yeah. hand. He knows what you're going through. You know what he's going through. It's good. He He's just... He's my number one fan, and when more I said... More than your mum? <laughs> more than my mum. No, no one could be more than my mum. But he, he's, he takes everything in his stride, yeah. you know? He's just... And he just... We look after each other, yeah. and, and, and that's the main thing. But he's so happy for me. Oh, I, I think he thinks I'm crazy. Yeah. And he'll, he'll be watching me on the ice like that, but he, he's just so amazing. Well, I'm so to lucky be, to have him. You have to be careful when you're doing this dance noise. Do not get injured, for goodness sake. I said I will be wearing a helmet, yes. knee pads, yeah. 
elbow pads until the very first show. OK, if you want to, <laughs> you want to be safe, you really do. Yeah. And Kim Kardashian popped in to see you, didn't she? She did. She did. When, was, that, was that Back to the Future? Was that... that was Back to the Future. Oh. And we, we met her in the interval and... Was that weird? <laughs> I'm a huge Kardashian fan and so I always quite, have been, yeah. you know. It's like when I met Dolly in Dolly Parton in 2018. But you're allowed to call her Dolly. I, yeah, <laughs> first word, first name terms. You did name, fine, of course I remember that. That was incredible. <laughs> but I just said, people always said to me, oh, what was Kim like, what was Kim like? And she was just in mum mode. Right. Her, her son Saint was there and she was just mum mode, so normal. And although I had no expectations, she exceeded them all. Well, that's very good to hear. Because yeah. sometimes meeting your idols is not the best idea in the world. Yeah. I'm glad it worked out. Now, look, you be careful doing Dance No Night, I right? Do. Keep all that, yeah, <laughs> the helmet, the everything, everything. Let's see if I, I'm like taking one week at a time, see if I can get through the first week first. Well, you're a grafter, so you'll put your heart and soul into Aww. it and I think you'll do really well. And Dance No Nice, it returns in January, but mm -hmm. obviously you'll be starting rehearsals fairly soon, I would yeah. think.